Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Caster Strip. Uh, ga Caster's Trap. God, I keep almost saying Caster Strap. Every single time. I just got straps on the freaking brain. What can I say? Anyways. Now let's see what the what's this little pentagram have to do with thing. This game is really good so far. I really want to finish it. Black and Doubt Hexagram. The years have caused parts of the symbol to fade. Like this ghost girl is fucking terrifying. Like... My character doesn't even acknowledge it. She's just fucking there, and that's what freaks me out. You find a new pa few papers on the table. One of them is written with words. It reads, Ignore those that is evil. Um, okay, that means ignore the ghost. I guess. Ignore those that is deal evil. Does that also mean ignore the hexagram? Alright, I don't have anything like this. Anything like that? Line red is a strange crystal. Okay, sweet. Another crystal. That's three out of ten. Ignore those. Does that mean... You can fuck right off. Does that mean just... Okay, I'm gonna do this room again without checking that. It reads, ignore those that is evil. Okay. Dust spiders. Is there anything else here? Letter about the owner of this home. Now, all I found in here is a crystal so far. Hmm. Is there an item in here I'm supposed to get? I'm not finding anything. Broken floorboards. Are they really that interesting? Don't fucking talk. Take that tone with me, me. Anything. And my God, it is hot in here. Like you have no idea. Thank God, summer's almost over. Oh, that's all I can say. Now I can take the plastic bottle? Why couldn't I take it earlier? I just spent like... Jesus, I just spent like almost 10 minutes running around trying to figure out what to do. What does the plastic bottle do, for God's sakes? I fill it with water, perhaps. Fill a bit. Yes! One fifth full. Bottle with water. The bottle filled to one. You liar! It just said fifth! God, I hate when you do that. Bottle bang. What am I? Alright. A bottle of pretty much caster's night. Found in hydroxide, aluminum, metal, and life's elixir. Release gas. Gas can volumize and build pressure. Plastic bottle, life's elixir, sodium hydroxide, aluminum. Okay, I think there was a bottle somewhere earlier that said, uh, it had, like, chemistry symbols. That's all I can think of. Because, honestly, I don't know what to fucking do. I, why couldn't I take that bottle before? That's just cheap. Take some. Yeah, now I can take that. Bottle of water. You shake the two fluids together to get a good mixture. Bottle of water and now obtained. Okay, now what do I collect? Salt. I guess. You have nothing to contain the salt? Okay. Can you put it in there? Oh, there. Hmm. Dirty old sack. Now I can take this sack that said nothing earlier. Dirty old empty sack. Okay, now I can go grab the salt. Like. What is this? That's not fair. I could see this stuff earlier and it wouldn't let me pick it up. Why couldn't- why can't I pick it up now? Man, I hate when games do that. It's not fair. I'm just supposed to know that I can pick up this stuff now? Sea salt received. What does that do? A sack of salt. Here's in front of you. Okay. I already have a sack of salt. Yeah, whatever. Nothing. Nothing happens at all. So what does that mean? What do I do with the salt? What am I supposed to do? In one photo, you notice a picture of a mirror with a strange symbol on it. A picture of a corpse lit on fire as a sack labeled salt. Nix sits nearby. Find pictures of demons. Um, okay. Am I supposed to... 
Am I supposed to use the salt on the hexagram? A hexagram? Let's try that. Honestly, got nothing else. <sighs> nothing happened. Oh, come on. What do I do? Like, it's not at all clear what I'm supposed to do right now. Am I supposed to use the salt on the skeleton? Nothing in this game is it makes sense anymore. Human bones. Human bones is not one word. You poured you poured sand over the corpse. Uh, I thought it was salt. Knowing you know you no longer need the sack, you toss it aside. Why did I do that? Bones of human bo bones of human bones were you found of key. Bones of human bones. That is the that is the best sentence ever. Although the lantern is foil. Okay, am I supposed to light it on fire? Because bones of human bones. Bones of human bones. I love that. I just love that so much. Okay, now I'm supposed Obviously, obviously, I'm supposed to light this skeleton on fire because a random book had a picture of that, so obviously it's what I'm supposed to do. That makes sense, right? <laughs> Is there matches somewhere? Can I pick them up now? Can I magically pick up something that said I couldn't pick it up earlier? They have similar skill with Dither Age are useless to read. Take it. Are you serious? Why would I think to come back here and do that? Oh, that's dumb. Like, that's just freaking dumb. Uh, I guess I'm supposed to use the paper to light that light the lantern? If that makes any sense. Uh. Alright, let's try the lantern. You do not have anything to light it with. Then what do I need the paper for? Ah, oh, this is getting, ah, oh, this is actually kind of getting annoying now. It's like, I'm running around not knowing what to do. I, I mean, I'm supposed to follow some, some demonic ritual in a b random book I found for some reason. And in order to do that, I need to go get items from places I've already examined. But why? Why can I only get them now? That's, that, that doesn't make any sense. Ugh. But so, well, I guess I'm just gonna have to go back to earlier spots and examine things. Clearly, there's nothing else. Here's your finger. I don't care about the finger right now. Right hourglass-like symbol on the abdomen. What stands out to you? It's silently rests above its web with a nest of eggs. Paper with... Uh, what? What? What is this all of a sudden? Reach in fast. Jab your finger against the spider to grab the paper. Web and spider eggs stick to your hand as you pull from the crate. Wiping your hand in the air a few times, you realize no amount of inertia can send the residue off. Avoiding the chance of leading spider eggs, you pants, you wipe your hand against the outer wall of the crate. Although you received a few splinters, you managed to remove the most of it. You then shine your light into the crate to note that the spider with the hourglass symbol is now crawling at the bottom. You've received a strange paper. Okay? On it are strange etchings and symbols. What? Why do I need that? Why did I pick that up? Disgusting crate where you fought the guardian spider and its eggs. No, that was on the table over there. Did I check that crate earlier? I don't get it. I don't have anything to light this. Yeah, I know. I don't have anything, apparently. With a few shiny rock. What? 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 Why couldn't I get this before? I checked it. Ah. Oh, I'm just gonna. I'm, I'm gonna end up st sounding like a broken record. But honestly, this is. It, it, like, oh, look at all these items I had. I could only have gotten by going back and checking old stuff. Like, why would I think to do that? It's like the only. Uh, the only reason that, that, that I managed to get it is because I just got lost and randomly checked everything. Like, why would I think to get these things, though? It doesn't feel like there's much logic behind it. Aluminum rocks. Yeah, yeah, let's combine that. Uh, yeah, whatever. 
Can I... Whatever, I'll just make a save and try the hexagram. Can't wake our fingers in front of you? I don't care, friend. I can't use the strange paper, apparently. I don't understand. What do I do? Do I go back to... Wait, do I go back to the body now? Can I do something there? Because remember, I poured salt on the body for... On the skeleton for some reason. Bones of a human bones. The salt now covers the bones. Yeah, whatever. Nothing happened. Bones of human bones. Oh, come on. I have all this stuff and I can't do anything with it. What the hell? Door with the bottle. Am I supposed to put the bottle through here? Why would I do that? Oh, come on! Okay, that one, that one's actually on me. I just, yeah, I've been here so many times, I forgot it said bottle size. You test the size of the hole by fitting the bottle through it. The two objects are coincidentally perfect. You remove the bottle cap and push the chunk of aluminum rock into the bottle. In only a few seconds, you hear a hissing sound. To prevent failure of the bomb, you quickly reseal the cap of the bottle for pressure to build up. Afraid of any possible accidents, you turn and huddle your head against your chest. Remains of the go uh, uh, remains of the bottle lies silently on the ground with the bottom end blasted. You peer up to the hole, which has gotten bigger. Your hand moves through the hole with ease as you unlock the door from the other end. Yeah, that ghost. I don't like her. As you enter the room, the appalling smell of rotting, rotten, uh, rotting meat intensifies beyond words to describe. Wonderful. Well, that took that took forever for me to figure out. A bucket lies here on the ground. Yeah, always take the bucket. Always fill it with water. Hydraulic acid, chlorine, bleach, citric acid. Citric acid. Any more likes covered in dust? Why that be there? Nothing in the mirror. Twist both handles. Nozzle remains dry. Like this way. Yeah, I'll check the body last, of course. On the ground, you see a young boy about the age of seventeen. You realize the horrid smell was coming for him. Shining light. Shining your light, you see there is no physical wounds on him. Will you inspect his body? Of course I'm going to inspect his body. As you lift up his left arm, you begin hearing a squirming sound. It is coming under his shirt. Carefully and slowly, you raise it up to find a pool of maggots feasting on his stomach. Ew! You continue with your inspection while avoiding the meal at its core. From his hand, you notice something shining for a quick second. You force his hand open to find a lighter. Giving it a few flicks, the lighter proves to work and has plenty of oil. You obtained a lighter. That's good. That's very good. Now I can light that skeleton on fire for some reason. I don't know why I want to do that. Hello. Fuck off, ghost girl. I don't know what your problem is. Uh, lantern. Bones of human bones. To prevent setting yourself on fire, you know that you must drop the lighter while lit onto the corpse. However, doing so would cause you to lose the lighter. Not knowing whether or not you will need the lighter in the future, you decide that a disposable match would be better. What? Are you kidding me? I did after all that. After all that shit, you're telling me I can't use the lighter? That's dumb. Ugh. Now what do I do? Oh, I see. I can light all these on... I can light all these now. Bronze key. Now that I have the lantern, I can light the candles. I'm gonna, I'm gonna light them all and I'll find the crystals now or something. Now I found a bronze key. I know what door that's for. I'm gonna go to it in just a few... After I light everything. Everything must be lit up now. I don't know what that chest is for. That's right, I'm lighting everything now. Why is there an item there all of a sudden? With the larger radius of your light, light you notice something glaring at the foot of the shelf that I've not noticed before. You put, it's a kitchen lighter. 
emit fire from the- It does not appear to have many uses left. Take the kitchen lighter. Okay, I guess that's what I need to use. Just light, light the skeleton on fire. But first, light everything. Some, uh, little rat just ran out. Hey, I got an idea. Um, how about instead of getting another match, I just use those candles I just lit to light the skeleton on fire. Oh, no. What? I can't? That's dumb? Oh, of course. It's silly me. I need to go find a disposable match. It's fucking dumb. Why can't I just do that? Yeah, screw off. Dead, freshly dead boy lies here for the meal of tiny worms. No, 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 no. Ew, dead bodies, ew! Let's check out down here. Light up everything. Hey, what we got? Search through it. You obtain a freezing block covered in suit. Okay. What is a freezing block covered in cold, dirty block? Why do I need that? Why did I pick that up? I don't understand. But if the game gives it to me, obviously I'll need it at some point. Ah, there we go. Item. Jar of vegetable oil lies on its side. Almost the broken barrel. Yeah, yeah. Small bottle. Of Why do I need this? Wait, what? You search has pr your search has proven the do-nothing. Well, excuse me, game. Anything. Anything at all. Well, looks like there's nothing. And I can't leave, as usual. Hold there, and there's nothing. All right, I know what door I need to go through now. Oh, fuck. You made me jump jump a little on the inside. Fuck you, ghost lady. Well, it's a little nicer here now that there's light. Door is locked. Yeah, yeah, where's the key I got? I got a lot of items now, seriously. Okay, the bronze key is not for that. It's probably for the chest. Chest is locked. I really like the, uh... I really like the lighting effects for the, uh, for this room. Are you serious? The br What is the key for? Every single time I find a key, I, I can't use it for anything. What the hell? Whatever, you know what, I got the, I got the stupid lighter, or kitchen lighter, or whatever. Let's just light the damn skeleton on fire. Frickin' Scully, it's all your fault. I'm gonna teach you, Scully. Are you serious? I can't- I have two lighters! I have two lighters, and I can't use either of them! Why not just use the damn candle? I don't understand this game, for God's sakes. What- what do I do now? What- 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 happened? I don't know what to do. Oh, is this just gonna be me wandering around again? Go oh, away, Ghost Lady. You're not scary anymore. Wait. Am I supposed to use the kitchen lighter on this? Okay, that apparently worked. Giving the kitchen lighter a few tests, you learn that it is now completely out of gas. You toss it to the side. Dusty air in front of you. Okay. Turn the paper. Strange paper. Cold, dirty block. W what do I do? What do I do in this game? I don't understand. Vegetable oil? I pick. Yeah, I did pick that up quite a while ago. Okay, fuck off. That doesn't work either. Then what? Bucket? the bucket there. You turn on the sink and fill the bucket with water. You received a bucket of water. Excellent. Now, can I use the bucket of water? Oh, Jesus. This is... What am I doing? What am I doing here? What am I supposed to do? I'm just randomly guessing everything for like the last half hour. Oh, what, what, what do I do? 
I really have absolutely no idea. Like, I don't understand the logic between between eh, not between between like any of the in, in any of the puzzles I've done in this entire episode. I still have that bronze key that does absolutely nothing. I don't get it. It says vegetable oil, a flammable oil in a jar. Like, can I use that? Is there, isn't there anywhere I can use that? Am I supposed to use it on the skeleton? Cause that wouldn't make any sense. I mean, I was already, pre according to the lighter stuff, I was already prepared to light it on fire. Oh, of course I was supposed to do that. I, that, how was I supposed to know that? Now I can set it on, now I'm ready to set it on fire again. What changed here? I don't get it. I, I, I don't get it. I, I, that changed absolutely nothing. When I did something, I was supposed. What am I supposed to do with the kitchen stove? Ah. Uh, whole this whole episode has just been me being like, I don't know what to do. I'm an idiot. Someone tell me what to do. A small matchbox box beneath the unhatched nest. Are you serious? This was in the first room of the game. I, I've i checked everything in here when I started. Why would I know to come back and find those matches? That is so not fair at all. Whatever, I got the stupid matches. I want to set the damn skeleton on fire and get out of this house already. Why did, Why am I doing all this stuff to the skeleton? I don't know. Why, do I, why did I pick up a key that opens absolutely none of the locked things I've seen so far? I don't know either. Just burn already. Hi there, Miss Ghost. I'd be s Jesus. That made me jump a little, but it wasn't honestly wasn't as scary because I just got so used to the sight of you already. The fire you've started has reached the point where it's become uncontrolled. That happened while the text was on screen. That wasn't fair. Oh no! Now I gotta go back to it. So oh, not fair. Not fair at all. Great, how far am I back am I? Wonderful. That wasn't fair though, the text was on screen. I was reading the text. Like, the t all the text in this game has been really wordy and descriptive, so I'm trying to take my time to read it, but you can't just let the house burn down while I'm reading. That's not fair. Ugh. Let's try this again. Burn. I'm sorry, what? Throwing the match would prove nothing. Bones are not naturally flammable. And that's where the vegetable oil comes in. Oh, Jesus. Screw you. Screw you. Bones of human bones. Yeah, I don't care. You're not scared anymore. Go away. Go away. You toss the buckets of water over the flame, put out the fire. No longer needing the bucket, you leave it to the side. Excellent. Now what's here? All that remains is a knife under charcoal and ashes of bones. Uh, okay. Now, uh, now brings us to the most important question of the day, kids. Why did I do all of that? Why did I need to go through all that to burn a skeleton? Why? Why did I do that? The ghost lady's not there. Can I use the hexagram now or some shit? Is the door unlocked? Did I break the curse? Okay, I, I'm just gonna assume I can leave the house already. What's this here? Strange how you did not know it. Oh yeah, you find it strange how you didn't see this item here before. <laughs> yeah, that's the first time I've said that. I found four crystals. Uh, I on, yeah, I'm sure all of them just magically respawned in areas I've been to. I'm not hunting for those. 
Wonderful. Wonderful. I can't do anything. And I still have a key that can't open anything. What do I do? What do I do? Door is locked. Maybe I should use a key. Oh, wait, no, the key doesn't work. What is the... What am I supposed to do? Hi, everyone. I'm back, and I looked up a walkthrough, and I know what to do, and... I mean, the answer was just so obvious. So obvious. How could I not think to use the cold, dirty block on the sink? To your surprise, you find a key frozen in a block of... I thought it was a brick! Why would... Why would there be ice at the back... A, a block of ice at the back of a fireplace? That doesn't make any sense. The thing would have melted. I don't care how much dirt's on it. You received key frozen in ice. Well, I think I know what I need to do with that. You place the block and watch the... Leaving just the key, you decide to turn the stove off. The key cools down. How would I have ever figured that out? Like, I, I just, I just, you know what? No, 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 no more. This entire episode is it? Okay, yeah, it is this door. Where am I? Where am I now? Yeah, sure, let's light it. Okay, everyone, now I think, I don't know how much more of this game left there is, but you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here, because I've been recording for almost an hour on this one part, and I'm getting a little annoyed, honestly. But anyways, thank you all so much for watching, and if you want to find out what happens next, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. Hopefully this part, next part won't be as confusing as the last, because honestly, first part was the first part of this was really fun, and then I'm just confused as hell, but anyways... Thank you all so much. Thank you so much again, and until next time, stay spooky, everybody. Bye bye. I'm in here. Shh, go away, go away, go away. No, 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 no! There I go. Let's try it again.